Welcome, welcome. This is Louise, and uh, I'm trying to post some stuff on YouTube and make myself a bit more productive. This is me doing that. Um, so yeah, we'll have a look at how to make a short film documentary style yourself. The only thing you will need is a tripod and, um, and a camera. Uh, the camera I'm using is a Sony A7S2 which is quite a old camera and I'm also using the 50mm lens from Sony. It's a really good lens, it's a 1.8. And I also use the, the gimbal Cyan Weeble uh, S, which is a great, great, great and really small portable gimbal, which I'm trying to keep as, as light as possible. And now I, I felt like the Ronin S was it was too much weight for me to carry around for several hours and so this one is is, is light. So yeah, just take it out anywhere I want and I can just use it easily. Just take it off my bag and just do it. I went to the park and just try and do something in like half an hour and so let's have a look. I like to take at least half an hour every day to go to the park. It helps me take a deep breath and clears my head. It makes me feel connected and it helps me to enjoy the rest of the day. I started by leaving the house like straight away and with the uh, Zion um, and the camera on mounted in the Zion, just literally just filming stuff around me and on my way to the park and once I was in the park I put my gimbal down uh, as a tripod and um, kind of just filmed myself uh, creating some nice compositions in the shots and then going there. The way I've managed to record and see myself uh, was through the Sony Imaging Hedge app, which allows you to uh, make a wireless monitor out of your smartphone. So I use my iPhone as a smart portable uh, monitor. So you can see the first bit, it was me just getting in the park and just, there was two benches and I just used one of the benches on the other side as a support for my Zion or Weeble. I also filmed myself in some shots which I was holding the gimbal and pointing the camera at myself, always with the phone in my hand so I could see uh, what was going on in the shop. Then I also used this same bench in the shot and it was just turned on to the side direction where the sun was setting and it made a really nice um, it gave a really nice orange warm color to to the video and just, this one was just me walking around the street and just filming on the way to the park and I kind of rearranged everything on editing and then also filmed my feet with the gimbal holding it and so you could see my feet but I couldn't really uh, manage to focus on my legs uh, so it kind of looks a bit strange I was hoping that it would focus on my legs but I couldn't be bothered I was just there for half an hour so yeah and then yeah this is just a panoramic uh, shot of, uh, of the park uh, there is a really nice cemetery and that's the, the chapel from the cemetery uh, yeah really nice sunset this one was also just on the corner um, there was a little place where I could just put my tripod f from the gimbal uh, and yeah just literally just using what I could as a uh, support, what I had available in the park and so this one was the best shot and I just left it for last but this is one of the first shots I also did but because the sun was already setting once I, I was finished with the, with the video I didn't have more time to get the better shot so this one was the, the best shot we had for, for this part so yeah this is the way I, I've done it was that I just literally put the tripod on the grass, pointed towards the sun and um, literally just um, just walked to the right distance, wait till the camera out of focus me and then just walk around from one side to the other. Afterwards I'll also put it all in slow motion so it's, it makes a slow, slower effect. Alright cool and 
thanks a lot for watching if you're watching and yeah i'll see you around next time hopefully